Lesson 4. Now that students are comfortable finding the GCF, let's go ahead and apply that skill and use it to simplify fractions. This lesson is broken up into three parts. In part one, we're going to use the shortcut to find the GCF, then we'll simplify, and the magic question will not work for any of these problems in the first row. In part two, we're going to use the magic question to find the GCF, then we'll simplify, and in part three, we're going to use the magic question or the shortcut to find the GCF, then simplify. Let's start with one example from part one. Look at box A. Here, we're going to simplify the fraction 6 fourteenths. So let's find the GCF of 6 and 14 using the shortcut. Don't factor both the 6 and the 14. Factor only the smaller number, which is the 6. So on this side, I'll write 1 and 6, and 2 and 3. Just like in real life, start at the bottom and work your way up. Can you do 14 divided by 6 evenly? Answer is no, so cross it off. 14 divided by 3? No. 14 divided by 2? Yes. Circle and star. Now, we're going to divide the numerator and denominator by the greatest common factor. So write divide by 2, divide by 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 14 divided by 2 is 7. Box your answer of 3 sevenths. That's an example from part 1. Now let's take a look at an example from part 2. Here we're going to use the magic question to find the GCF. So larger number divided by the smaller number. Can you do 18 divided by 6 evenly? Answer is yes. So the GCF is 6. Write divide by 6, divide by 6. 6 divided by 6 is 1. 18 divided by 6 is 3. And box your answer of 1 third. Now let's look at an example from part 3. Here we have the fraction 6 twentieths. Let's see if we can use the magic question to find the GCF. Can you do 20 divided by 6 evenly? Answer is no. So let's use the shortcut. Find the factors of only the smaller number. So here we have 1 and 6 and 2 and 3. Just like in real life, start at the bottom and work your way up. 20 divided by 6. Can you do that evenly? No, so cross it off. 20 divided by 3. No, cross it off. 20 divided by 2. Yes, circle and star. That's our GCF. Write divide by 2 and divide by 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. 20 divided by 2 is 10. Box your answer of 3 tenths. And on the bottom it asks, which method did you use? Here we use a shortcut, so we'll check that off. And for the subsequent problems, students will check off which method they used.